Hi, my name is Kayla Robbie, a product review expert and bargain hunter. Today, I'm going to discuss the top five products you are searching for. I have selected these products on my top five list after hours of research, feature reviews, and performance analysis. Let's go and see the top five product reviews now. Hi everyone, I'm Ken with Orion and this is the SkyQuest 6-inch Classic Dobsonian. It's a 6-inch diameter reflector on a Dobsonian base and Dobsonians are my personal favorite for viewing the night sky. Uh, they're point and shoot, you just push them where you want to go, let go and you're there. Um, it's probably the best bang for your buck because you can get a large aperture telescope on a very simple base uh, for the money. 6 inches is uh, big enough and bright enough to see not only the moon and planets, but also lots of deep sky objects. Uh, all the Messier objects, which are a collection of deep sky objects like uh, nebulae, galaxies, star clusters. And this particular telescope comes with a 25 millimeter plossel and a uh, Orion reflex uh, site, a zero power reflex site. Hello, I'm Kent from Orion Telescopes, and this is the SkyQuest XT 4.5 Dobsonian. It's a four and a half inch reflector on a Dobsonian base. So what that means is you've got two motions, up and down, left and right, and it runs on uh, smooth Teflon bearings. So you get a nice, accurate and smooth motion, uh, even at high power to follow something. Four and a half inch aperture is good for uh, easily seeing detail on the planets, the rings of Saturn, uh, a cloud belt or two on Jupiter, as well as the moons around Jupiter. And on deep sky objects, this is bright enough to see all the Messier objects, which includes some uh, nebula, some galaxies, uh, and lots of star clusters. It comes with two eyepieces, a 25 and a 10 millimeter. And you also have a 6 by 26 finder scope to help locate those objects. Hi everyone, I'm Ken from Orion Telescopes, and this is the SkyQuest 8-inch Intelescope Dobsonian. It's an 8 inch reflector on a Dobsonian base and 8 inches is large enough to get into a lot of deep sky objects as well as the moon and planets. So uh, nebulae, galaxies, star clusters are all within the range of this telescope. Now it's not an average Dob in that it comes with a computer system built onto the base. So the idea is you punch in what you want to see and it will tell you where to go. It's still manual but it gives you directions and an arrow and, and uh, how far to go to find, center, and uh, follow an object. Um, so it makes it very simple to find things in the sky. It comes with two eyepieces, a 25 and a 10 millimeter plossel, and a 9 by 50 finder scope, big enough to see a lot of the fainter objects. Hello, I'm Ken with Orion Telescopes and Binoculars, and in this video we're looking at the SkyQuest X-T8 Classic uh, Dobsonian Telescope. It's an 8-inch reflector on a Dobsonian base, and Dobsonian just refers to the, uh, the style of the base, left and right, up and down. Very simple movements, very easy for beginners to use, uh, very simple setup, no complicated uh, polar lining necessary. It's just a great telescope for the family or for the beginner that just wants a really nice view of pretty much everything that's out there in the night sky. 8 inches is big enough to see all sorts of detail, uh, not only the moon and planets, you've got a lot of light grasp, so deep sky objects, nebulae, galaxies, star clusters, they're, they're all within the reach of an 8-inch telescope. It always helps if you get away from the light pollution of a big city, but there is there are thousands of objects uh, available in the night sky that are within reach of a telescope like this. It comes with a couple of accessories. Um, it's a 2-inch Crayford focuser, comes with one eyepiece, a 25 millimeter plausible, and a zero power finder scope to help aim the, the telescope. Uh, the, the focuser is my favorite part, it's two inches, so you can add on uh, two inch eyepieces to get a very wide field of view, great for those really big uh, deep sky objects. So anyways, the Orion SkyQuest X-T8 Classic. Thank you very much, clear skies. I'm Ken with Orion Telescopes and Binoculars, and this is the Orion X-T8 Plus Telescope. Uh, it looks a little different than our normal Dobsonians, and there's a good reason for that. Uh, it it's based on the classic 8-inch telescope, but we've added some new features and some accessories. So I wanted to go through some of that with you and let you know what's new about this one. Uh, first off is the color. 
Instead of our normal black uh, for the classics, we've added this metallic twilight blue uh, paint job. I think it's a little more elegant and, and uh, gets away from that standard, like I said, black uh, color scheme we've had in the past. We've added a two inch focuser that uses a 11 to one reduction gear. So you've got coarse focus here and then fine focus here for when you wanna really fine tune the position of the eyepiece for, for a very critical focus. If you look down on the side, the uh, tension is a little different. Our classic XD8 used a spring. Well, we, we modified this and used now the uh, uh, adjustment knob from the telescope. So you can fine tune the tension when you move the telescope up and down to, to suit your needs. On the very bottom, you can see the white strip that we've put around the uh, outside of the base. That's a, a little accent strip, but it works as a visibility strip at night. Uh, at night when you're looking, uh, when you're at a star party and everything's very dark, it's sometimes hard to see the telescope. So the strip actually makes it easier to see so you don't accidentally bump the telescope with your foot or when people are walking around. Uh, just a little more convenient to, uh, to see the telescope at night. And then uh, we've got some accessories as well that we've included with the telescope. First off, we've included a 28 millimeter two inch eyepiece. And then if you look down here, we've got the 10 millimeter high magnification eyepiece. Also a Barlow lens, this will double the power of that 10 and really zoom you in on the, uh, on the objects that you're looking at. And then some standard accessories, an inch and a quarter uh, collimation cap to help the alignment. And then a two to one and a quarter uh, adapter so you can switch between the, the two inch eyepiece and the inch and a quarter eyepiece. And they all sit inside a, uh, an eyepiece rack. This is a, uh, an eyepiece rack with a two inch hole and then three inch and a quarter holes so all of your accessories can fit. And then something different, we also include a solar filter. Now, not only can you use the telescope at night to look at all those faint deep sky objects, but uh, you can use this during the day to look at the sun, not lose any sleep, and uh, see the sunspots, some of the granulation around the, the sunspots themselves. Uh, a nice uh, accessory to use with a telescope. And then speaking of, the, the, the telescope itself, eight inches sucks in a lot of light. So you can use it for not only moon and planets, the rings of Saturn look amazing, uh, cloud bands on Jupiter, but this pulls in so much light you can see all those faint objects in the sky. Not only the, the showpiece objects like the Orion Nebula or the Andromeda Galaxy, but thousands of other NGC objects, much fainter things as well. So again, this is the Orion XD8 Plus Dobsonian Telescope. Thank you very much, Clear Sky. Thanks for watching the video. As I said at the beginning, I'm a bargain hunter and I have found a big discount link for you. Please have a look at the description below and get your special discount link now.